When we return, it's Valentine's Day, and we have one of the great Valentiners of all time, Jill Bork. If you're married, if you have a girlfriend, if you have a boyfriend, Jill, you are about to help couples fall in love even deeper. Is that correct? Yes, of course. That's what I'm here for. In fact, I looked at one idea. You mind if I give it away? This no. is something I've thought about. Well, Take okay. your loved one down to Justin Herman Plaza and have a pillow fight. Oh, God, Jill. <laughs> that was the, yeah, that's number one on my list. Forget <laughs> everything else. I think I love you right now. Wow. That sounds here great. We go. Here All we go. All right, Jill Bork and I, you'll see two people's eyes connect. Anything can happen. Let the sparks be with you next. <laughs> All right, every Valentine's Day we have Jill Bork on. She is a, uh, a talented comedian. Uh, Lucky Couples, Jill, right, is the name of your uh, play? Oh, how We First Met. How We First Met and then for Lucky Couples, right? Yeah, well, um, they're lucky because if they get to be on the show, it's uh, by vote, online voting to be on the show. We right. ended the voting. Today. And this is on Valentine's Day, which is Saturday. Saturday, that's right. For, and where is it, the Herbst? Uh, Herbst. Oh, yeah. terrific. Yeah. So what are your plans? What's that? I'm going to go home and talk to my wife. I'm one of these guys I just let the, the night unfold, <laughs> all right? I, I kind of just pretty much put the kids to bed, take off my clothes, and let it happen. <laughs> No, like, no, do you know what I mean? Like, I mean, what, no, what, no, it's not. You, just, just, you like the spontaneity of, yeah, of the evening. To me, to no say. Planning. To, to, to no shoes, no planning. No. Jill, just. look at me, and look at me good. If, if you come home and say, okay, we're going to do this, mm -hmm. then we're going to do that, well, and then we're going to. How robotic is that? I just pretty much go like this and say, <laughs> baby. Let's make it happen. <laughs> no, isn't that, wouldn't that be? And, and is that what your is that your wife's preference too? What's that? Does no, she, she, like no, she goes up and watches TV, and I end up down <laughs> in the room by myself with a book. But the point is, at least I'm naked, and I'm available if she wants me. How's that? Naked yeah. and available. All right, Gary let, Radnitz. Yeah, thank you. But let's talk about this. Uh, the the uh, people that when do you have to? Here's the thing. If you're romantic only one day out of the year, no, would you would you agree okay. that it's phony? You have to be romantic more than just Valentine's Day. Why are you always day. picking fights with me? Well, well, I have Jill, I you want to be on or not? <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. No, I'm teasing you. Go ahead. Lead me into this. Go ahead. Well, what I came on to talk about was five inexpensive ways to celebrate Valentine's. Okay. Recession I was going to get to that, but I wanted to show people kissing to get folks in the mood. Okay. Go ahead. Do, do right, that. Get the right. people kissing. Now, do you have a man? No, no. Uh, Jill, please. You have a man, correct? <laughs> I, I do. I have a husband. Okay. Oh, oh. look, people kissing. Ugh. Ugh. Yeah, That's no, gross. you got to admit that is gross. That's now, not nice. now, if this guy came home and said it's Valentine's Day, let's sit down on yeah, the couch. I know, yeah, I know you don't like public displays of affection. Oh, you do know that? Yes, yes. you mentioned that last time. Yeah. And, and so, yeah, so I picked out things All right. that are not PDA involved. Let's go to the list. And Jill's such a good sport, I want to remind you, Saturday night at Herbst Theater, you will fall in love all over again, correct? Well, it, it's a yes, it's a it's a comedy show called How We First exactly. Met. Exactly. All okay. right, now this one sounds, I don't know, Pillow Fight at Justin Herman Plaza. Would you do that? Uh, that's great. Okay. It's free. Okay. <laughs> yes, it's free. <laughs> well, 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 so so is stealing a banana from the supermarket. It's free. But the no, point it's being, cool. they do what, these all over yeah. the world. There's okay. This, these mass culture things where it's like it's called a flash mob. Everyone shows up. They have their pillows, okay. and then there's pill uh, feathers right. flying, and you know a little bit of aggression. Right. Kind of hot. Well, how yeah. old is your man? <laughs> no, no. You, the, is your man roughly your age? Oh uh, yes. If he took you down there, would you say, "Jeez, please"? I mean, you would do I, that. I, I'm okay. spontaneous. Okay. Kind of like me. Except with my clothes on. Thing. Well, that's, I'm sorry, you're inhibited. <laughs> uh, strolling through time at the Presidio is another idea. It's a, it's a walk on, on Valentine's Day. Uh, the, uh, the Presidio has put this together. It's really cool. It's a, okay. a guided walk um, on down Lover's Lane, okay. which was this lane in the Presidio uh, where the soldiers would walk back and forth to their sweeties. Okay. That and I like. Oh, yes! Yeah, you yeah, know, that, that sounds nice. Okay, yeah. good. Okay, okay, all right. I thought maybe one winner. Okay. Book reading at City Lights. Couldn't you stay home and read a book? Well, this is an, uh, a special book reading. It's a Valentine's Noir at City Lights. Okay. 8 o'clock on Saturday. Okay, fair okay. enough. Uh, I can tell you don't like that. No, no, it's just okay. It's okay. It's okay. All right, okay. All right. right now, strolling through time at Presidio, I, I'm kind of off okay. on that. Okay. Roller disco at Cell Space. Yeah, this I is, like this. Okay, this is on Valentine's Eve, Friday the 13th. Um, it's part of the SF Indie Fest. Okay. And it's like a whole roller disco thing. I bet you did roller disco oh, in your day. It, love it. All right. How we first met at Herbst. 
That's mine. That's you, of course. Yes. You want to know the truth? In order, I think seeing your show would be fun. Aww. That's the best. And it starts at what time, Jill? 8 o'clock on Saturday. Okay. Because I'm going to tell you first, the pillow fight at Justin Herman Plaza, I think if, if I was a police, I'd arrest anybody that did that, <laughs> right? No, have you ever seen anyone do this? Or are you just guessing? No, I've seen it. I mean, I haven't been able to go because I've always been busy on okay. Valentine's, but it's it looks fun. Yeah. You know. How long have you been with your man? Uh, be eight years. Wow. And he's been romantic, uh, but he doesn't want to pop the question? What do you mean? I'm married. I've oh, got you two are kids. married. Like, oh, well, like then, of course. Uh, okay. You are such a good sport. I'm gonna say <laughs> one more. Three plugs. The Herp Theater, yeah. Saturday night. The great Jill Bork. One of the, and I, I've seen the play. It's fabulous. <laughs> it's fun. And, and you're a good sport. Thanks. Happy Valentine's Day, Happy Jill. Happy Valentine's Day.